It's already morning. When are you gonna wake up? Take this! Oh, oh, oh! Stop! I'm awake, I'm awake! Oh, give me a break. Don't bug me early in the morning. I didn't poke you, I kiss you. Kissing doesn't hurt you that much. Physical affection with friends is essential to me. I was lonely because you weren't home. You were on a business trip. Oh, I remember now. I heard that there's a machine that allows you to kiss your partner from a distance. Is that possible? Yes. This is the English newspaper I subscribe to for studying English. The article says there's a machine that allows you to kiss your partner from afar. Really? How can you kiss someone far away? According to this article, a Chinese company has developed a device that uses motion sensors to send kissing data. The kiss data is sent to the other person who uses it when you kiss the silicon lips. By catching the data, you are making the experience more realistic. Ah, speaking of China, it had been a lockdown for a long time. That's right. They are forced to stay at home. So I guess there was a demand for this kind of technology. If the Japanese government did such a forced lockdown, it would lose power in the next election. I agree. Anyway, even if you can produce the action of the kiss with data, you can't produce the warmth and the smell of their real lips, right? Although it is not possible to produce the smell, it seems that there is a function to record and replay the sound and the warmth of the device in order to increase the realism of the kiss. feel the great obsession of the developers. But I really want to kiss you directly. I don't want to kiss the silicone. What do you think? Mm, I don't think such devices would be popular in Japan, even if the device is more realistic. Why do you think so? Even if, for some reason, you can't kiss your partner directly, there are other ways to show your love, right? I think you should express your affection verbally or through messages. That makes sense. Above all, I'm concerned that the machine was developed by a Chinese company. What do you mean? This technology is great, isn't it? Yes, but don't you know the TikTok program? What is it? The Chinese government has issued a law called Personal Information Protection. The law requires Chinese firms to hand over their data to the government. You mean… If that happens, the case machine data could be a real threat to our personal data. If leaked, the data about who and when you kissed and how you kiss how warm, how soft, the sound. Too embarrassing. It is like torture. I can't live with that. Many Japanese people are shy. I kiss everyone I love. I envy your honesty. Anyway, many people would be hesitant to recommend their partner to use such a device, I think. Speaking of shy people, it's insane for couples to flirt in public, right? Well, yes. For example, it is disrespectful to hug or kiss your partner on the train. People around you will feel embarrassed. It's a sort of harassment because you can see things you don't want to see. I sometimes see tourists flirting in public places. Please! Do it in your hotel room if possible. By the way, I heard that 
Trillions of couples are the most likely to cause a star among the journals of YouTube channels. If you flew too much in a video that anyone can watch publicly, you might be hated because you are not classy. Maybe so, and I'm worried about what would happen if they break up. Anyway, a bird kissing its own wand causes a star, right? Well, correct. Now. Oh, stop, stop! Your love is too painful.